Hello, and welcome to another Health Nugget on Exposing Truth Ministry. We are so excited today to have Sister Avia with us. And Sister Avia is going to tell us about the benefit of fasting. Now, Sister Avia, where I come from, if somebody says she fasts, that's not a good thing. It has to do with fast. So, so, so this fasting, it has nothing to do with people's business, does it? No, it does okay. not. Okay. And, and, and this fasting thing is becoming very popular. What do you have to share with us about, it's not being fast, but fasting? Fasting. We're going to be looking at some uh, benefits of it and the reason we need to do it. So let's get right into it. Today we're talking about the benefits of fasting. It has indeed become quite popular. Before we get into the presentation, I want to take a look at Mark 6, verse 31, that says, And he said unto them, Come ye yourselves apart into a desert place and rest a while. And that is what fasting does to our system, gives it a rest while it's healing. So we're living in a world today where toxicity has become the norm. Everything is so complicated and toxic. Our environment is polluted, and a polluted environment equals polluted food. Many of the toxins that we're exposed to daily, we cannot taste them, we can't see them, or we can't smell them. And these toxins, you know, they, they accumulate in our bodies and they contribute to sickness and disease. So I want to look at outdoor pollution, talk about the exhaust from the vehicles, also gas and heavy metals from industries such as refineries, factories, incinerators, etc. Research has shown that over 2 million tons, which is about 4.5 billion pounds per year of these toxic chemicals are recognized carcinogens, meaning they're cancer causing. Some of these chemicals include formaldehyde, sulfur dioxide, toluene, and many others. Too many to name here. So we might think, well, if I can't be outdoors, I might as well stay inside. But being indoors will not protect any of us from toxins. We're still exposed to many of them. We have chemicals such as styrene, carbon tetrachloride, you know, many others that we're exposed to, or carpets, furniture from made from pressed wood, glues, paints, all of them release chemicals in the air, and we breathe that in. Even the very air conditioning units and the heating systems that we use are culprits. They can contain moles, spores can travel throughout the building, and we breathe that in. And it does not matter if it's an older building or a new building. Then we have to think about toxicity from within our own bodies. So our bodies struggle with overgrowth of bad bacteria from time to time. And one of the main culprits for that is inappropriate use of antibiotics. Inappropriate use of antibiotics can actually destroy the good bacteria. Uh, bad bacteria in the body produce endotoxins, and these can be just as dangerous as pesticides or solvents that enters the body from the outside environment. An overgrowth of bacteria in the small intestines can cause excessive fermentation, and this can create even more poisons, which are called indoles, scatols, and aminos. Then we have to contend with the free radicals that actually can damage ourselves. So the big question is, what can I do? Well, we can relieve our body from this kind of toxicity through fasting. And fasting is a very safe, natural, powerful, and effective way of healing the body by cleansing it from bad fats, chemicals, and toxins. So what is it? You know, it's on many people's lips right now, fasting, you hear, you know, everybody talking about it. It's actually uh, abstaining from all or some food and drink. We're going to look at some benefits of it. And these are just a few. There are many other benefits that I didn't uh, include here. 
This one uh, fights inflammation. Many of us deal with inflammation from time to time. And it says here, while acute inflammation is a natural immune process used to help fight off infections, chronic inflammation can seriously affect our health. Research shows that inflammation may be involved in the development of chronic conditions such as heart disease, you know, amongst others. Some studies have found that fasting can help decrease levels of inflammation and promote better health. It can promote blood sugar control by reducing insulin resistance. So it does that. It, it, it enhances um, heart health by improving blood pressure, triglycerides, and uh, cholesterol levels. Research showed that alternate day fasting could significantly decrease blood pressure as well as levels of blood trig uh, triglycerides, uh, total cholesterol, and LDL. Uh, promotes blood sugar control by reducing insulin resistance. Uh, again, more studies have found that fasting may improve blood sugar control, which may be helpful for those who are at risk of developing diabetes. In 2023, a study of 209 participants found intermittent fasting for three days per week can reduce the risk of type 2 diabetes by increasing insulin sensitivity. AIDS in weight loss does this by limiting uh, calorie intake and boosting metabolism. A study done in 2015 showed that whole day fasting could reduce body weight by up to 9% and significantly decrease body fat over 12 to 24 weeks. Another one found that intermittent fasting was more effective in inducing weight loss compared to continuous calorie restriction. Along with these, you'll also experience more energy, improvement in your skin, your skin becomes clearer, and even your eyes, the white of your eyes, whiter and clearer. You have nothing to lose from trying uh, a fast today. In another presentation, we can look at the different kinds of fasting that many are trying for different reasons, whether it's for spiritual or for physical well-being. All right, so some of my sources, of my main one was Toxic Relief, written by Dr. Don Colbert. I also looked at healthline.com and worldometers.info. Thank you so much, Sister Avia, for explaining to us good reason for us to fast. Have you been fasting? Have you used that as a part of your health routine? Let us know in the comment section below. Remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you will know when a new health nugget is available. Thank you for watching and may God bless you always. Thank you, Sister Avia.